But the, the traditional markers, are, there are a couple different definitions that people use, but they typically involve obesity, in particular a, a, a larger waist circumference or a central adiposity where people tend to store more fat in the midsection, uh, high blood pressure, uh, high blood sugar, and disturbances in cholesterol, in particular uh, high blood levels of triglycerides and low levels of HDL cholesterol. And so usually to meet this specific definition of metabolic syndrome you have to have uh, at least a couple of these markers, three out of five uh, is usually the, the sort of benchmark to being diagnosed with metabolic syndrome.